Buenos dias, good afternoon, good evening guys, wherever you are in this beautiful world, whenever you're watching my YouTube video, welcome, it's like it's this, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel for the newcomers, my name is Dita Hutu, today I had some small eyes because yesterday I spoke at a beautiful finca and uh, I had some drinks with some Bitcoiners afterwards and then uh, yeah, it was a lot of rum, it also with the B, it wasn't Ducati, it was Suvaron, Suvaron, Spanish rum, really good one, small headache but let's jump into the charts quickly because we see some really cool stuff in the Bitcoin chart also taking a look at the Ethereum chart uh, two special charts that are showing what is happening at the moment again I'm saying this every day but they do show what is happening at the moment yes the Bitcoin revolution is happening but let's jump into the charts before I start to talk too much again I want to keep it short uh, the first chart is BAM face okay my face is okay it is of course the four hour chart I love to look and watch the four hour chart because there is this pattern that we are creating and it could look like this huge falling wedge and I don't know look if it is a validated pattern now at the moment because you know it's not completely yeah, and it is in the four hour maybe if we look in the day chart later it's even more clear but we can see that we are doing something like that which could mean we break out and if we then break out we should be breaking out somewhere to that uh, beginning of there so that's 50k which would be beautiful um i will keep my eye on this you know we don't know bitcoin will go sideways for some time i believe before we just break out again but let's see guys uh, it's, a, it's a strange period at the moment for bitcoin we got some view volume again we found this resistance about 38k we need to break that 38k and make a new um, higher high guys because like you can see the lower high over here lower highs lower highs and the lower high again and yes low uh, higher low higher low probably here again a higher low so beautiful tradable but we need to create a higher high to see the reversal of the market let's jump into this chart bam um, this is the chart we've been looking at you know we can see that cross over here but you can see that the green line is a little bit bending sideways uh, a little bit more up so maybe it will take till the 20th or maybe it will turn around if we get this huge kick volume in but i think we are a little bit late for that volume because the the indicator is lagging behind so it's already dropped till here let's see we need a huge volume to um to not have that bearish cross and again I don't think the bearish cross is the most bad thing because we have seen it before after bearish cross here in March we got a bullish cross a golden cross and we had to shoot huge bull run so yes it isn't the end of Bitcoin let's jump into this one bam Ethereum um, why Ethereum because I want to show you in Ethereum how did the bam bam indicator is performing for Ethereum um, because I showed it for Bitcoin, but the BAM BAM indicator is also working for Ethereum or Tesla or gold or any other stock that you can find. So if we look here at the short, the flag, we would need to have three confirmations. So we have the short flag, one, we have the closing of this red candle down below the yellow stepping line, two, we have the BAM BAM crossing the blue line, the white line to the downside, three, we have the green in the bottom declining and here the yellow and the blue starting for a red dot five and the red line on top six six confirmation of that short and if you would have taken that short let's see this if you would have taken that short like even when you took it late over there and then till this moment now you would be in a six percent almost seven percent profit without leverage with a leverage of 10 that would be a 60 percent profit so yes the bam bam indicator is also working on ethereum or any other here this one will also be check let's check it over there short flag closing down below the stepping line crossing of the bam huge area of yellow red line on top would be a beautiful short if you would have taken that short a little bit late again over there 
you could have stepped out of it. The long flag over here, 8.4%. That's like 16% without leverage in two days. That is how the BAM BAM works. If you want to trade the BAM BAM, then please use the referral links down below our videos. Um, I will paste uh, a beautiful new banner in here, and then you can see that we use Bybit at the moment. So for trading, leverage trading. So if you want to use Bybit, uh, down below the video, there is a link. Click that link for this huge sign-up bonus that you can get, guys. Ooh, I'm a little bit tired. <laughs> Let's jump into the next one. Very special chart. Now, BAM. Look, I really like this chart. I found it on TradingView. And I just love how it shows what the next cycle could look like. And for me, it's beautiful to see that if you look here to the top, that was the first cycle. So we all calculate from the bottom of that cycle. So from the bottom of the cycle, the first cycle, wham, went up to there. The second cycle from the bottom of that cycle, the yellow one, went up to there. The third cycle, that is the most of you know that cycle, that's the cycle to 2017, the bull run, from the bottom, it evolved all the way like this to there. So we have these three lines that we you know, can see as the cycle top uh, trend lines. The blue one, the red line, and this blue line on the bottom. Now, the beautiful part is now this orange line is the current bottom over here and the current price. So from that bottom, the orange line has been a little bit above the yellow one, then came down to the blue cycle line. And now we are like performing the same as the blue cycle line. Then the blue line had this huge dip. Look, you can see from there to there, the orange line, the current one, is doing the same. We had that dip now. And now the question is, how is this going to continue? Is my face in the screen before... Um, I need to check. No, my face is perfectly fine. It's not in the screen. And um, so let's go back to where I was. So now the question is, how is this going to evolve? Are we going to go like this here to the first trend line? That would mean we reach 140K, uh, I think somewhere in January that should be then. Or are we going to reach it over there, the second trend line that would be February, March, I think in 2022, or even later to the third trend line, which would bring us to 270k, but that would be then, I think, mid 2022. Um, can I see this? Because normally we can see the dates. Maybe I need to refresh it. So, yeah, that's more easy. Like this. Look, it would be January or March or July. So, that is how the Bitcoin price could evolve and then show. Um, consistence that they would keep following the downward trend line in the new bull cycle top really cool chart this one as well bam here you can see maybe even better and um, you have the cycle the green one you have the blue one and now you have the orange one and this orange one is the current one so the type of site like it was on the 1.3 time fibonacci after the halving it became the 1.4 time fibonacci after the halving Will it now become the 1.5 time Fibonacci of the halving? That would mean that we would reach the top somewhere around April 22. So, and it would be around this area over there. So, which would be around 100K. So, all of these charts are showing us, yes, it could maybe take longer than December. It could go even to April. But all of them also show that we are going to go above 100K. And that is what I really like about these charts. Let's check these charts the last two charts i'm going to keep it short today because of the bacardi headache bam here these two charts that i want to share with you guys uh, really cool i need to do it like this now of course um yes something like this i think and then i can draw so on the day chart I found this chart somewhere on Twitter. I don't even know who created it, but all the, all the shout-outs to the one that deserves it. On the day chart, we can see that this falling wedge is being created. Like, like you can see, you know, this is a line, and we have these two lines over here, you know, that one and that one. And that's a falling wedge, like you can see here in the image. And the falling wedge could go back to the target over there which means that we could go back to 45 to 49,000 US dollar if we break out of that falling wedge hey which would mean what well, you know 
uh, I will delete that one, which would mean that we go up, down, down, up, down, up, and some may break out, and then we go to the target. So this falling wedge is really interesting to look at. Um, which charts do we have more? Bam, this one over here. Also really important to see, I also found this one somewhere on Twitter, I think. I just shared Twitter charts as well because I want to show you the opinion of other people. This one is telling us that there is a bullish or um, a divergence. And that's what we can see at the moment because the price is moving here. The price is going in this downward trend over there. But the indicators are all going the opposite direction, which means... That is a bullish divergence, which means that we could have the target as well of $45,000 to $49,000 US dollar. So all of these charts showing the same. Last chart of the day, bam, this one, I like it. This is when the moment that El Salvador passed the Bitcoin bill is exactly over there. And from that moment, we saw a huge increase in the transfer volume of OTC desk, which is people buying Bitcoin over the counter, not on an exchange, but over the counter. So the moment they pass the bill, a lot of rich people, hedge funds, and all those guys started to buy Bitcoin over the counter. So we can see the increase of that volume here. You can see the line going up, which is very positive, I think, for the market, which means that the OTC market is not dry anymore. They have enough Bitcoin to sell anymore, which means that it's everybody in that market Bam is believing that Bitcoin will go up in the long term because that is why they are investing. That was the short video, guys. I'm not going to make it longer because my head is still bouncing, like from the B of Bacardi, bouncing Bitcoin. All Bs, guys. Um, I hope you really enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, give the video a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, and please leave a comment as I love to respond to your comments. Also, today there will be another video, and that one will be about dreaming because I want to talk a little bit about the dreaming. You will really like the video. I made it yesterday, but I needed to edit it. That's why it's out today. Um, but I think you will like that video because that was a video I made without having this um, after the drug day. How do you call it? Qatar. Qatar, we say in Holland. Uh, it's a small Qatar, but the coffee is always helping. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you tomorrow again. Bam!